connect the air. I set it to 60 PSI. I guess open up the cover, connect for the 20 source. Yeah. Give it 12. 12. It's open at 50%. Okay. Because it was previously calibrated. That's right. Yeah. So to erase the memory, turn the dial till you reach reset. 18. Eight. Okay. Eight. Okay. Push the button down and it'll count down for you. Okay. Now the memory is erased. The plug went down. Now we're going to start calibrating. Air to open is fine. Yes. 35 is the pin position. Max. We're going to change it to 15 millimeters. Because that's the, that's the, the spring. Okay. That's the travel of yeah. the valve. Yeah. Okay. And then you accept it. Next. This is fine. That's your milliamp. Increase, increase is fine. That's the milliamp, what it was set at. You continue till you see initialize. So P15. Push the button and it'll count down for you. And then it'll start auto calibrating. So it's going to move the rod back and forth. That's right. And that's a couple minutes? Yes. Okay. I guess I'll keep recording. You can see it, it's going up yeah. slowly. So, if it will be paired with the valve, it's going to move together with the exactly. valve. Exactly. Okay. So, when it hits the seat, it knows that that's zero. When it goes to the top, it knows that's 100%. Okay. So, it'll know internally. Okay. So, it will see that it hit the resistance? That's right. Okay. Here, there's no resistance. Yes. So, it'll be fully closed. Yeah. Yeah, so we assume that it's all the way up and down. Yeah. Okay. Now it's okay. stopped at 50, only because I left milliamp at 12 okay. milliamps. Right? Then you can check it by going at 20 milliamps. Here it is at 100. 100%, yeah. Okay. Then 4 milliamps, it's closed. Okay. So it will be zero because it's fully closed. Okay, so that's it. That's it. Okay, thank you.